Well, experts are warning of critical blood shortages this winter after the Red Cross declared a blood emergency for the first time earlier this year due to COVID-19. Typically, winter storms and holiday schedules slow down the donation process, but the head of the University of Michigan Health Blood Bank says that the many illnesses hitting the U.S. right now will make things even more difficult. I'm quite concerned about the possibility of blood shortages this winter. There's a number of things that are sort of coming together that could be a significant problem. As I'm sure you know, that there's a lot of respiratory viruses that are circulating right now, such as RSV, influenza, COVID, and even adenovirus. So unfortunately, blood donors are getting sick and they're not able to donate. That means that the people who are well need to step up to donate if they can. While University of Michigan Health and the state as a whole are not facing major shortages yet, supply has started to dip. Experts say it's important to build up the reserve now by encouraging donations before and just after the holidays, but make sure that you are healthy when considering a donation. If you're not feeling well, particularly if you have fever or productive cough or you're taking antibiotics, you should not donate until you're completely recovered and you're off of antibiotics. If you have had COVID or positive test for COVID, you should wait until you're completely recovered and at least 10 days from having a positive test. There have been changes recently to donation eligibility and the FDA may, may make more changes in the coming months.